right here, I just set up a basic web page. Nothing really much on here, really just to have someone to be able to embed these things into. So first I'm gonna go over to YouTube. I have a video I've looked at here. Um, I'm gonna go down to where it says share. And there's a link right here that says share this video. Instead of using that link, I'm gonna click on embed. Now, <clears throat> under this embed tab, we have a lot of different options. We have the embed code. And here we have a few different things we can do. We can resize the photo, or excuse me, resize the video if we like. For this ex example, I'm just gonna keep the size of this, but just be aware that typically for almost all of these, you can do that. Now all I'm gonna do is copy this code out. And the biggest thing with this, I just wanna be sure I put it on my code side. If I paste it on this side right here, I'm just gonna get the string of code. So I'm gonna take that back, and I can see right here my code where I wanna embed it. So I'm gonna paste just hit refresh and right there you can see uh, there's a placeholder right now for my video so if I go ahead and save my web page and then do file preview and browser I'll be able to see my video and I can watch that video from my web page now um, <clears throat> it's important to remember that we can do this with a lot of different content online things like SoundCloud um, different photo sharing websites and things like that, we're able to take the embed code and put it on our site, which is really nice. Um, I'm going to show you one more example, but with Google Maps. So I'm going to go ahead and search Lewis University. And this is going to be very similar to the way we do it with the YouTube video. Um, I have the area on my page that I would like to embed, so I click right here on the link button and you can see once again I have the link directly to the page and I have the embed code. Um, one thing to note is that yes once again you could customize this so if I click customize I get a little pop-up window I can change the size um, and I can do a lot of even custom sizes so a lot of different things I can do. For this exercise I don't really need to do that but once again I'm just going to go down the bottom copy this embed code Go back to Dreamweaver and embed that right there. Once again, on the embed side, or excuse me, on the code side. Now I'm going to refresh. Should have, so I should have added in a break right there. I'm going to save and go ahead and file, preview and browser. And now I have my video and my map. So. <clears throat> Um, the big thing to remember this with this is that when you want to embed these content in Dreamweaver, you just have to make sure we do it on the code side. Save it and then preview in browser. Also, kind of keep your eyes peeled for other websites that allow you to do this because it's a nice way to put a lot more content on your site. So if you have any other questions, let me know.